morning guys today we're gonna be vlogging this week it is october 9th today it's monday it's also 6 what time is it 6 20. i just woke up i have a business law test today i've been studying with my index cards and also I have one other class after and then I think I'm gonna have like a fun fall day today because it's Columbus Day so my parents are off and my boyfriend's off so I think we're gonna go pumpkin picking today hopefully it's a nice day out today I decided this week I'm gonna vlog because I feel like I haven't vlogged in a while last time I vlogged was my first day of school and it's been like a month of school so I also have a lot of tests this week and I want to get back on track and stuff. I haven't been to the gym in like a month. I've just been like kind of adjusting to everything. But yeah. Um, so hopefully this vlog is interesting. Yeah. Okay. Sorry. I'm still so tired. I wanted to get up at 5.30 to study. But I literally couldn't wake up. So yeah. Let's make some coffee. I have to leave my house by like 7.30 because my class is at 8 a.m. But I want to study a little bit before I go. Let's make some coffee though. get back on track at least go back to the gym be productive and stuff i have a lot of tests this week i don't know i just want to vlog it's i have to leave at 7 25 to go to school what time is it right now it's 8 30 it's 6 39 right now i just put my contacts in and washed my face and made a cup of coffee like i said i have a test today i don't know if i said that already i have a business law test today so yeah, I'm gonna try and study before I go to school today for a little bit. Mama um, made flashcards. Flashcards are the best way that I can study. Mondays and Wednesdays like are annoying because I have to wake up so early, but I get out by 11. I washed my hair last night, but I slept with it wet, so that's why it's not looking the best, but you know, whatever. Okay, I'm gonna do a little bit of studying and then I'm going to Get ready for school. I feel like you guys are crooked. Why is it like crooked? I don't really know why. Anyway, I just filled my water bottle and put my coffee in my little coffee to go cup. I'm about to leave for school now. Um, I packed up my bag and I'm gonna go. Hopefully, I get to class early so I could like study all ready for school hopefully you do good on this test i'm very nervous but hopefully we slay the test this is my outfit this is like what i wear the majority of days at school just some comfy clothes because i just like to be comfy and i'm ready to take this business law test i'm praying for at least a 90. So I'm back from school. I got an 89 or 
87 on the test, which I wanted to go to 90, but you know, it's not horrible. So I'm glad that that's over. I have a marketing test on Wednesday, and then I have a retail principles test. That's like online, so I have until Thursday to do it, I think. I'm kind of nervous about those two because there's like so much material in both of those classes, so I'm kind of nervous for that, but I'll study before, obviously. Right now, I'm getting ready to go pumpkin picking with my family and my boyfriend. I'm so excited. I don't know what I'm wearing yet, but today is such a perfect fall day. It's like so breezy and chilly, but like sunny, so I'm really, really excited. And it never happens that like I'm off, my boyfriend's off, my family's off. I'm always either working because every time they're off, it's the weekend and I'm always working on the weekend. So I'm literally so excited. My first test in business law. So very excited. After I did that, I'm like, mm, I should be a lawyer. Just kidding. If you guys don't know, I'm going for business. I am in a program called Business Retail Ma Management and Marketing. I'm like... That's like an associate's degree though, but I think I want to get my bachelor's after. So I've been thinking about schools to like transfer to after I finish. I don't know if I should just like change my major to just business in general or keep retail because I do want to work in like the fashion vibe. I also want to own a store, so that's like why I decided to major in that. But I feel like if I majored in just like business administration, it might be better. I don't really know. I will show you guys what I end up wearing or like me deciding what to wear. But I'm super excited. And I'm so happy that I got that test over with and I got a good grade. Like it genuinely is like a weight off of my shoulders because there was like six questions on the test that I was like not 100% sure if it was right or wrong. I am excited to go pumpkin picking and tomorrow or tonight i don't really know me and my boyfriend are gonna carve them and last year i carved mine and it was a cat i'll insert a picture if i can remember to find if i can find one but mine was like super good but i don't know what i'm gonna do this year i want to do like snoopy but that might be like too hard to draw so too hard to carve but we'll see um so i'm gonna finish doing my makeup and then pick out an outfit to wear let's figure out what we're gonna wear Obviously, I want it to be really cute fall vibes, possibly picture vibes. I have my fall essential. These are my Abercrombie corduroy pants that look good with my grandpa sweaters. So, like, it would look super cute with this sweater, but I wore this sweater a few days ago, so I'm kind of like, eh, maybe not. I also recently thrifted this really cute, like, pale yellow sweater from H&M that's really cute that I could possibly wear. Also, oh, I have this like denim skirt that's like kind of long. I could wear that with like boots. I also have this really big varsity sweater that could look really cute with it also. So let's try some stuff on. Okay, I love this sweater, but I just don't know how to style it because it's so like oversized. Like, I don't think that looks that good. I could try this new sweater. This was the H&M one. It's kind of cute. But like, I don't know, it's not like giving anything in particular. Also, this Polo Ralph Lauren sweater would look really good with my corduroys. And this cute little turtleneck could look so cute. Okay, let's try on some other stuff. This sweater is such like a good basic white big grandpa sweater it's such good quality i love it but maybe not for today okay this is the new ralph lauren, ralph lauren sweater i got it's so cute it's just like white and has like the yellow gold one i don't know if it looks better with it like tucked like this or like out i don't know if i'm gonna wear it with these jeans up it looks super cute with like a skirt this is it with my corduroy pants. I feel like this is super cute. It's kind of really cute how it looks with the denim skirt. I don't think I'm gonna like this. I don't like love that at all, but like, 
kind of has potential. So this is cute. Like this little moment with some boots. I have these Zara boots that I just recently got that I love. They're like little riding boots. Like this, I don't know how that looks. Do over this jacket. That is that giving? This is kind of cute. Like this jacket with this, the skirt. I don't think the boots look that good with it though. This plain white top too, that could be cute. Um, this my leather jacket. Okay, I need a few minutes to decide. Okay, what do we think of this? I'm wearing these Skechers shoes. I don't know what shoes to wear, but I feel like this is really cute. I feel cute. I just hope that this is a good choice. I think this is what I'm gonna go with for pumpkin picking. Now it is Tuesday, October 10th. It's about 8 a.m. I have classes at 9.30 today, which is really nice. I can just like chill in the morning and not get up so early. I have a test tomorrow that I'm really nervous about because there's like literally so much material. I'm off today, again. Monday and Tuesday are usually my days off now. Class until 1.45 and then I, I think I'm gonna go with Haley today to go shopping for her birthday party because I'm hosting her birthday party this year and it's in like two weeks. So I told her we should go to the Dollar Tree and get a bunch of Halloween decor because I feel like in the past, her all the Halloween stuff gets sold out so quick. So I wanna get some Halloween decor. So I think I'm gonna do that after school today. And then also me and my boyfriend are having a little date well, we're having a little spooky date. We did that last year. It was so fun. We like got takeout and we painted like pumpkin things. I got a Target. Here, I think we're gonna carve the pumpkins we got yesterday. And um, we also have these like wooden pumpkin things. Here, I'll show you. What we did, that could be super duper cute. Um, so we're gonna decorate these also tonight. Before I go to school or before I get ready for school, I'm gonna just like chill, do some schoolwork get ready for school, and then go to school. I don't know what I'm gonna wear today. Okay, so I'm about to leave for class. This is what I'm wearing. Very comfy and cute, I feel like. Class until 1.45, I have my accounting class and my intro to business class today, so yeah. I'll see you guys after class, or maybe I'll film a little bit at school. I don't really know, but look at my flowers that I got yesterday. They're wildflowers. They're so beautiful. Um, and I love them. Getting ready for me and my boyfriend's little spooky date at home. I can either wear these Halloween jammies. I got these last year from TJ Maxx. They're super cute. I can wear these that have like the t-shirt and then the little shorts. I might wear these. Hold on. These have little witches on it. Snoopy witches, they're so cute. Here in my sunroom, I put a little garbage bag over it because these are the little pumpkin things that we're gonna paint from last year. And then I have a bunch of acrylic paints and paint brushes. I got these at the dollar store today. They're like for the pumpkins. And then we're gonna do it here. I lit this cute little candle.
is the pumpkin I painted. It's so cute. I mean, it's cuter when you like look far away, but it was super cute. Good morning, guys. It's about, what time is it? 7, 12 right now. I'm studying for my test and I'm super chilly. My first class today was canceled, so I only have to go in at 9.30 for my test and that's it. So I'm very nervous for this test because there's literally so much material on this test. I've worked today at four. I have to take an online test today, so I might do that today. And then I want to go to the gym today because I feel like gross. I've had a cold for the past like two weeks. I feel like it's rearing towards three weeks. So I'm going to study for this morning. I'm probably going to do some schoolwork too because I have so much stuff to do. Okay, so I'm about to leave. For my test, I'm leaving early because I'm anxious that- I want to get there early, first of all. I don't want to be late, and I want to be able to study while sitting at my desk because I just want to make sure I'm there in time. Just anxiety things. Um, but yeah, this is what I'm wearing. Brandy sweats. I just got these. I love them. They're like a off-white cream color. They're so cute, but I'm so scared I'm going to get them dirty. Um, and then this sweatshirt is from Abercrombie. Um, my hair is like day like three here and it's already getting like heavy and annoying and I might just put it up. I've been like going over my notes and there's just so much material on this test that I'm just like very scared of how it's gonna go. But hopefully I do fine, like, it's at a point where, like, either I know it or I don't at this point. I can only cram so much. So, I pretty much got down the terms. They're just, like, random things that, like, he didn't put on the list that I didn't focus on that I'm just nervous about. But we took, like, a practice test, and I'm just going over those things. But I am going to leave my house in, like, 10 minutes because I want to get to school early today. I have to get there by 9.30, and I want to get there by 9, so I can sit in a desk and study my notes. Took my test. Pretty confident in my test. Um, I don't get the grade back till Monday, though, which is so annoying. I got out of school a little early because I finished the test a little early. So it's 10.45 now. So I'm going to take my retail test now because I'm still in, like, the school mode. And that's due tomorrow, so I'm gonna get that done now while I'm still in like the zone. So I just have to do this test, and then I'm going to go to the gym, and then we'll see how much time I have before work to do whatever. But I got myself some water, I made myself some tea, I have my notes out. I'm just gonna get into the testing zone right now. About to go to the gym. I just took my test. I got an 85, which isn't bad, but, you know, it's not amazing. I haven't been to the gym in literally so long, so I'm excited to go. I feel less stressed because I did all my tests that I needed to do this week, and I just have to do my homework, which isn't that bad, but I had, like, four tests this week, so there was a lot of stuff I had to do, and I was just getting really stressed about that, but now that it's all over, I'm not that stressed anymore, which is great. Um, so yeah, off to the gym we go. I'm back from the gym and I got myself a coffee. I have, it's like 2 o'clock right now. I have work at 4 and I have to take a shower because I went to the gym. But I'm debating if I should wash my hair. This is like such a debate in my head constantly. Like, when is the right time to wash my hair? Like, I'm trying to find like my hair schedule. Like, usually I'll do... I wash my hair Sunday and Friday, which like isn't even a good schedule because whatever. But this is like day three hair, and I hate it. Like I, when my hair gets like too gross, like just it being down annoys me. So I can either put my hair like slick back tonight, like to go to work because I'm hosting, so I like, I need to look nice. Or I can just like wash my hair and like blow it out, which I never blow my hair out because I'm lazy. But I don't know, I'm like kind of feeling like blowing it out today.
sweating so much, but I always feel like such a bad, bad bleep when I blow out my hair. And I realize how long my hair has gotten. It's grown like so much. And I've just been like, I was in that like middle length stage for so long that I'm so happy that I'm finally like, I feel like people would say I have long hair now. You know what I mean? It's not like medium length. It's 2.51. It actually takes not that long to like blow out my hair. Um, I use the Shark Flex Styler. I love this thing. It's so good. Makeup's all done. I've been using like brown lip liner recently and I feel like it looks really good. I think for work today I'm going to style this Polo, Polo Ralph Lauren. I always say Ralph Lauren. I don't know why. But this sweater that I thrifted, I think I'm going to wear it with a mini skirt and then some docks. I feel like the skirt's a little too short. Like, I, or this is just too long. I wish it was like up to here. I don't know. I don't really love this, which I'm surprised because I thought that I would. I love the sweater though. It's so cute. Wait, what do we think of this? Outfit. I don't know. I love this sweater so much, but it's super oversized that sometimes I have no idea how to style it. Like, it's also like kind of nice out today, so I don't know if I should save this outfit for like a more fall day. This definitely isn't a good angle, but like, I don't know. It's super cute. I don't know if I should wear it today or if I should wait for it to get chillier because it's like super fall vibes, but it's super cute. Hey guys, this is what I'm going with. It's probably gonna be hot out, but I don't care. I feel so cute, but I need to leave because I've been trying on outfits for the past 30 minutes. Hey guys, just got home from work. Pretty easy shift. Got down the home package. Nothing exciting. Well, to some maybe. Got a whiteboard and some whiteboard markers because when I was studying, I'm like, honestly, having a whiteboard is probably super great to study with because I was doing this studying method where you write down everything you know about the, the subject. Like, let's say I wrote down like everything I knew about market segmentation. And I just like kept writing it and writing it and rewriting it until I got it like completely right from memory. So I got a whiteboard so I didn't have to keep using like paper from my notebook. And I can just keep writing it on my whiteboard. And then I also just got a pack of whiteboard markers with like a eraser. If anybody has any good studying tips, let me know because I'm very open to them. Here's the whiteboard. I feel like I'm in like middle school. Can you read that? Yeah, that's my exciting Amazon package. Now, I'm home from work. I work again tomorrow and I have class until 2... No, I have class until 1.45 tomorrow. So, that's what's going on tomorrow. I am going to hopefully go to the gym tomorrow morning. I'll wake up at like 6, go to the gym by like 6.37 and then be able to get to class by... What time do I live? I leave the house like 8.45. Um, that's my plan. That's what I want to do. Pretty good day, honestly. I'm glad I went to the gym. I'm glad that I got an 85 on my test. I'm glad that I feel like I did good on my other test. Work was fine. So for the rest of the night, my mom's making soup, so I'm literally so excited to eat the soup. But I'm gonna like shower, take my makeup off, get ready for bed. Sorry, I'm gonna take the garbage out. And then I'm gonna do some schoolwork. I have a bunch of homework assignments to do. I'm gonna go to sleep. So I'll talk to you guys tomorrow or if something interesting happens. Good morning guys, wait, is it soon? Okay, um, what time is it? 6, 15, I just got gym clothes on. I'm going to the gym. Be proud of me, guys. I'm so tired, but 
So I'm wearing the gym, the same sweats as yesterday, and then just some biker shorts. And a sports bra. I have to put my contacts in, but I'm gonna wear a hoodie too. Ugh, I'm so tired. I'm gonna go to the gym till like 7.30, 8-ish. And then I'm gonna go back home and get ready for school. It's literally still dark out. Well, it doesn't look dark out, but it is. Oh, and it's cold. I changed my hoodie because the hoodie that I got, like, sent to me, is super cute, but it's, like, not soft on the inside. And it's so cold that I want it to be, like, soft and comfortable. Um, but, yeah. Yeah, let's go to the gym, besties. I'm getting hyped now. Now I'm up. It was hard to get up, but now I'm up. And now, let's go to the gym. Guys, my nail broke. Oh my god, this is so depressing. Howard, I got on a simple fit for school. Another drill, Brandy Sweats, Abercrombie t-shirt. It's only 8.04 right now. I showered, got ready. Um, I'm probably gonna edit some of this vlog because that's what I'm gonna post on Sunday. Need some coffee. I haven't had iced coffee in a while. Actually, I literally had iced coffee yesterday. I haven't made iced coffee in a while. I have been making like hot coffee recently, so. I was just in the mood for iced coffee because I was really sweaty. My cute little Halloween cup. I'm gonna go to school and then I have to go to work. My class ends at like 1.30 so I only have like two hours-ish to do stuff before work. Hi guys! Um, so I'm home from school. I'm literally about to go to work. But school is fine. It's a good day at school. Um, I was able to do some homework during my break, and yeah, this is what I'm wearing to work. It kind of is the same as what I wore yesterday, but a little bit different. So in love with sweater weather, so this is a H&M sweater that I thrifted. Just put a tank top under, and then these are Abercrombie jeans with my low, with my clogs. Kind of the same vibe as yesterday, but... Yeah, I love it. Also tried that apple crisp macchiato today and I don't like it at all. I almost had an anxiety attack because of it because I was like, that sounds so good. Like, let me get a venti, but mm -mm. it was not good. So after work, I think I'm going to my boyfriend's house and staying there for the night. But tomorrow I'm going to go to a coffee shop, see Jackie, do some work at the coffee shop. And then also possibly get these nails done. I'm so depressed about this. You have no idea. That was like kind of my day. I didn't really vlog that much today. But after school, I didn't really do anything at all. It's like 12 now. I left the coffee shop, I hung out with Jackie for a while, and now, somehow, I'm at the thrift. I was passing it, so I was like, okay, I'll just stop in. Oh, I'm grabbing lunch with Melanie later, because I literally haven't seen her in so long, so we're just gonna get a little lunch before she has to leave, and then I have work. So, it's actually a really beautiful day out today, it's just very, like, fall, cold vibes, but, yeah, let's go into the thrift and see if we can find anything today. Okay, I'm back. I am gonna show I'm gonna make a video soon on like recent thrift things so I'll show you guys what I got then in a different video but I think I'm gonna give this to Melanie when I see her I found this gold tag Victoria's Secret set and because of one of you guys you told me that the gold tag Victoria's Secret stuff is like more vintage so I mean I don't know if she's gonna like I'm sure she's gonna appreciate it I know she's not gonna wear this like every day or anything but you know, even to save for, like, her wedding day or something. I just, like, literally couldn't pass it up because it's so beautiful. So it comes with this top that also has the gold 
Victoria's Secret tag. So it has the top and then these are the slip bottoms. It's so beautiful and amazing and it's like in literally perfect condition. So I'm gonna give that to her when I see her, but I wanted to show you guys. She's coming over at like 1.30 and it's just about to be one right now. So we're gonna have Chick, no, we're gonna have Chipotle. I had a really good day. It's a beautiful day out today. And um, yeah, I don't really know how long I'm gonna be vlogging for. I don't usually do anything on my weekends at all. I'm more, of, it's more eventful <laughs> like during um, the week for me, but I will update you guys 